Jack, plastic crap! You doing this to me? Who do you think you are, you piece of plastic shit? Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Screw you! It is my favorite Alburo movie. It died. What else can I do? It's probably not plugged in. What? Damn. No matter. I can buy a hundred more. Now, Tommy. Each month, a freelancer sails into Vice City and moors his yacht. He sells his cargo to the first boat. I want you to take the speedboat and beat all the other shitheads to it. Then you bring the cargo here. Okay? Let me guess. You thought I could use a guardian angel. We got some competition! Boy, I hear you. So, Tommy, we know it was Diaz busted our deal. So, why in the hell are we running errands for? The more we learn now, the less we have to learn when we take this town over. I like your style, it's man! Time for the real friends, man! Ooh, I tell you what. Yes, thank you. I expect you to listen to each other, and I will only step in where necessary so people on the air don't forget what my voice sounds like. <laughs> so, I want a clean fight. Nothing below the belt or in the chops. And remember Maurice's motto, which a very wise man, my father, once told me. If you listen, one day you might be hurt, and when in doubt, use the smell test. Watch yourself! They're coming from all over! Oh, oh, as fast as you can! Police morale is at an old time low. Eat it! Eat it! Sleep with the fish! Do you think the government is doing a good job? Absolutely. Those statistics are interesting, but like all statistics, they are also irrelevant. Let me give you a better statistic, Chavez. In 1980, when I was elected, you were, according to the intelligence gathered on you, a man with no mission. You worked as a clown at birthday parties, corporate functions, bar mitzvahs, and go-go bars. You realizing that you were a... There are gunmen on that, daddy! ...others decided to become an actor. And despite going up for 17 auditions that year, you only got work as a fluffer in a sex head video. Your tax returns show that you earn less than $2,000. Suffering from anxiety, you attended group therapy for a year and considered getting a sex change. An idiot liberal felt sorry for you, and now you host your own radio show, write a newspaper column that finds my bird. More trouble up ahead! You want some of this? Thank you. Best friend, and you're on top of the world. So answer me this. Can you really say the years of living under my administration have been bad for you? Uh, uh, we are not talking about me. This is pressing issues, not pressing Maurice. Yes, excuse me, if I may, can we get to the part where we press the issue? You see, that's what's wrong with this city. Liberals just want to open the floodgates. Good shooting, my friend. You're a real, proper, grade-A lunatic. Well, thank you. See you around, Tommy. Okay, Mr. Lance Vance Dance. I've got a clear shot. <laughs> Thank you.